Assalamu alaikum. Good morning. Wow. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I am so glad that you are all here. Thank you so much for all of your kind words and all of the resources that you sent to me. I am thrilled to be reading the Quran and learning so much more about things that I did not understand and definitely had preconceived notions about. So deconstructing and learning something new, this is amazing. I was reading the Quran last night and I came across a really, really interesting part. I never knew, even growing up Christian and reading the Bible, I never knew that Mary had a backstory. It was never talked about. I did not know where Mary came from, other than the fact that she was from the town of Nazareth. Okay, I want to read this part. God chose Adam, Noah, Abraham's family, and the family of Imran over all other people. In one line of descent, God hears and knows all. Imran's wife said, Lord, I have dedicated what is growing in my womb entirely to you, so accept this from me. You are the one who hears and knows all. But when she gave birth, she said, My Lord, I have given birth to a girl. God knew best what she had given birth to. The male is not like the female. <laughs> I name her Mary, and I commend her and her offspring to your protection from the rejected Satan. Her Lord graciously accepted her and made her grow in goodness and entrusted her to the charge of Zachariah. In case you're wondering, yes, that is the Zachariah who is the father of John the Baptist. I never knew that story. I did not know any of that about Mary's mother. In Christianity, I was always taught that Joseph was the main part of the story of Jesus being born. Like, yes, Mary, virgin birth, voila but that all the emphasis was put on Joseph because like, how could a man take a child who wasn't his and raise him in love? Like it was very, he was very bolstered, but I am seeing and reading this and I'm going, Mary was the important part here. Mary, not Joseph. Mary was from the line of, of David, of Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, like Mary was the important one. I am having the best time reading. I cannot wait to share more with y'all and learn more. I just got to the Surah chapter, uh, titled um, The Women, so I cannot wait to read that. And there are so many more things that are blowing my mind about the Quran. I am overjoyed right now. It is incredible. I love it so much, so much.